Good evening, everybody. Merry Christmas Eve Eve. I just came back from a lovely trip to it's an old town, H and M. I haven't bought anything since I got back from Texas. I mean, a few, maybe a few things like you know, lipstick and stuff. But I'm trying to find a comfortable place for my phone somewhere. And my iPad somewhere. So first thing I have to show is a new phone case. This is hopefully I'll be getting a new phone soon. I want the Christmas you want it. It's like three bucks. So it says all the jingle ladies. I don't know, it's kind of backwards for my nails. Most of them look pretty good still. So. I painted them like two days ago and they're getting chipped already. Yeah. Then I'm going to take my old one off because I kind of feel like it's just. I think it's a little Christmassy, but not too much. The next thing I bought was. For it. I'm not gonna show my head for a little bit, so I only know my lens. The next thing I need to have is a sweater and it has bling on it. And I'm gonna peel off the this price not the price, the the size. Has the bling thingies on it right here. It's hard to see it, but and yeah, it's black. Black is always good to sweat. I sweat myself, and that kind of defeats the purpose. That is neat. Am I still filming? Okay. Move somehow. It's and I'm upside down now. Yeah, sorry about that, everybody. Thing I got was a dress, and now you know I bought a couple. And you know it's like freezing cold outside, but I, I mean these things are for my Florida trip. I got this sheer thing with birds and flowers and pretty stuff on it. I, I would wear it here, but you know I have to wear like three layers under it. I'm wearing like. Three layers, and I was kind of sweating when I went to see Mary Poppins returns. So that was yet another dress, and oops, I had to catch my eye down before it fell on the floor. I got this one. It's black again. It has a flower print on it. Sorry, we can't see that. And I bought some pink and black gloves to match. And apparently I have a bunch of other ones. I got a headband. In case everybody couldn't tell, I have roots in my hair and I need something to cover them up till I get my hair done, which is not for another, I don't know, a couple of weeks. You can tell right here. I just want to say I am blonde. It's just. The next thing I got was yet another accessory and it and it says Happy New Year of course. We near and alone tomorrow's Christmas, but for a second when I saw it I at first I thought it said happy birthday and I was like, oh so I can buy that for myself on my birthday, which isn't until February, which I'm running to Florida, so it's a big announcement. I get everything. Trying to make sure if I got everything on that. And the last thing I got, which was super, super, super awesome. Now, I've been a big fan of Friends, like most people, since I don't know, Millennium, probably. I didn't watch it the first few years, and personally, I like the later ones better. But the Friends are, I have this picture on my wall somewhere, so hidden behind stuff, but. They're drinking milkshakes. The gang. Jimmy and Malachi and Ross and Rachel and Chandler. We're all there, of course. That was pretty much it about now. Wednesday, hopefully I'll be doing a what I got for Christmas video. I don't know. 
I probably won't be doing a video tomorrow or Tuesday because it's Christmas even day, of course, and but if we don't see everybody by then, I wish everybody who celebrates Christmas a very Merry Christmas and I look forward to watching everybody's Christmas videos in the next few days. No, it's kind of short but sweet, but hopefully I got everything in the video. I still need to do a, what I got at Lindsay Sterling's concert, you know. I also got Starbucks, of course. I think there might be one that's bigger than this, but look. Look at how much tea is in this thing. And Barnes and Noble. How much plastic do you need to go through? It's crazy, yeah. It's kind of cold out. I'm bringing a cold beverage on a cold night, but actually I had hot tea at lunch. Which I didn't eat lunch till 2 because the movie started at 11. And I very much like all the new things that I bought. Like I said, I can't wear the dresses because it's too cold, but. You know. Well, we just got home. It's getting dark, and Harry Potter's on, and tomorrow's Christmas Eve, and. I could just undo my roots. I should just wear a wig for the next couple of weeks until I can get my, if I can get my apartment pushed out a little bit. We can head to Florida on the end of January for my birthday in Feb. Of course, when I get back from that trip, we'll be doing another haul. And then we're going to Chicago in March, hopefully. So I'll be doing a haul there too. So early mean end of this time anyway. You know, I keep trying to want to, I do want to, I do want to, you know, a Christmas look, but I wear the same makeup, like, every day, and it's always, you know, but the, the glittery eyeshadow from this MAC palette that I got at TJ Maxx. I was thinking I want to send me presents. I would like the Kat Von D Shade and Light palette that TJ Maxx has. P.O. Box 100, Erie, I.L. 61250. That's my address. If anyone wants to send me anything. I wish somebody would send me stuff. Come on. Anyway, I'll see everybody in my next video. Hopefully Wednesday. We are going out again, so... I don't know. Hopefully I'll get it up eventually. I mean, who knows what will be in that video. And like I said, I need to do a... What I got Lizzie Strong. I mean, I have to wear what I'm wearing. I just kept going back and getting more stuff. And oh, what it says, and now she's finished with her tour. And I wish her Merry Christmas. And thanks for putting on an amazing show, girl. And like I said on Twitter not long ago today, I, you know, I hope she had tons of fun on her tour. And that concluded yesterday. She's probably home right now, relaxing or on her way back to either Utah or Arizona. Also, if anybody, I'm going to make a suggestion. Go download Lindsay Sterling's book. And there's also an audio book, too, and it's very, very, I like listening to it as much as I like listening to her Christmas CD. Thanks, everybody. Merry Christmas. Ignore that. Ignore my roots. By the way, you're in Mulder and like three of these headbands, and they're 12 bucks for these three things. You get these at Party Safe for about half that much, I think. But uh, I will see everybody in a few days. I know I haven't done a video in a while. I'm just so busy running all over the place trying to get presents, and I finally mailed them. And if my friends are watching, I'm sorry. It's been so crazy. You know, I have a friend I sent one present to. She's. she's and now in Florida for a while. My best friend is in Texas, so I had to mail it to her lovely house, which I've never been to, but I like to do that. But yeah, it was great going to each and I tried to go last, I don't know, a couple of weeks ago, and we didn't. I don't know what happened. I don't think we either didn't have time or 
I don't know what happened. But like I said, I haven't bought any new, new clothes for since I got back from Texas. I mean, I bought some there, but it was very rarely that I got to go to the mall because the people there at Marbridge wouldn't let me for some stupid reasons. And I need to do a video about that. Plus, it, like, the old, you know, best things of the year or something. I mean, trying to find time is hard. I mean, I'm not, I can't imagine people who do videos on YouTube every single day. That's hard. Especially when people have kids and, you know, running all over the place trying to get their shopping done. And, you know, if they don't have kids or, or have a spouse or a significant other or something, then... You have to make time for everything. It's crazy. Everything's crazy these days. You know? I know everybody's doing it, like, on TV, doing the best of the year and everything, and looking back on it all is... And I feel like this year is kind of like 2016 all over again, because, you know, once again, we keep losing celebrities every day, and, you know, it's crazy. I mean, I know... People die every day and all that, but it's sad. Yeah, you know, my number four it looks huge. You know, I really wish somebody could buy me an actual camera so I can make better YouTube videos than the ones I'm making right now. Right. Yes, I'm blabbing on again, but I. As long as he requires on, at least I have some new clothes in tomorrow's else Christmas to you, so get it, get up, get ready, and you can pick it. See, I will do a video tomorrow. Tell me if it's not before, I have to do it before my aunt and uncle and cousin come over. You know, I rarely see my cousin, he lives in Australia. Half the time he comes here because of his visa thing. You know, that six months rule, apparently. But, uh, that's it for now. I keep saying that. I mean, now the video's 12 minutes long. I also got a couple of magazines at Barnes & Noble. I got Marie Claire and I got the Chicago one. Yeah, I'm addicted to Dookie. It's like my hometown. I live only two hours from the city, so... On the other side of Illinois, not like Springfield or someplace. But, yeah. Like I said, I'll be doing a video in Feb about... You know, H and M, Tap Shop, Express, Forever Twenty One, Sephora, Mac. I mean, here, I mean, there there is an Ulta in the city, but you know, I just go to Sephora and Mac anyway, since it's right next to the hotel now. And so I'm going to go to down to Water Tower Place, which it's where Oprah used to live, and she did her show here so for so long. Now she doesn't live there anymore, of course, but. Yeah, I should buy that. And then Brad and Angelina's old house in New Orleans. And by the way, I saw Nicholas Cage in New Orleans once. That was pretty cool for my friend's birthday. Because she lives in Mississippi. And we drove down and had lots of fun. I mean, it was a little crazy a couple of times with the weather. And her friend's mom got sick. And her feet were hurting. I mean, how do you beat her from being in a car for that long? I thought they were walking to around New Orleans from going from the French Quarter up to like the Garden District or I took a taxi or something I don't think I don't know if they have that have Uber in New Orleans so they should yes yeah, I'm still babbling on but it's great to do videos but like I said it takes so much time and energy to make something you know you know, Chris, everybody loves Christmas, you know, I got for Christmas videos as much as, you know, like, you know, like, you'll watch stuff on New Year's Eve, and then, you know, it's like, I mean, now I'm thinking, like, you know, this year's gonna be over in, like, a week, as of Tuesday. It's not completely over yet, but, you know, we're getting there, it's crazy, but. Also, anyone can go download Lindsay Sterling's Christmas album, too. I haven't mentioned that already. I mean, that's 
person, my favorite album of the year, obviously, because I just saw her a couple of weeks ago, and it's not a great show. Uh, she comes out and like her alter ego was name is Philma and her, her funny wig and I mean her hair is pink but it, um, she was wearing a red wig but she had red hair for most of her career except for last year it was blonde and now it went pink and all of a sudden you know you know earlier this year I was like I wasn't that obsessed as I was you know until months ago when she announced that she was coming here and I was of course like I'm like I have to see this girl and then my my brother-in-law took my nephew and my nieces to see her in Savannah Georgia the other day and we had fun and I had pictures because I have pictures I like him I also took some awesome videos of course and that's my picture in my background my phone, which I know I probably should do Christmas something. I guess Christmas Eve. Okay. Well, she plays electric violin. For anybody who didn't know, she did a. We, we, her mom got a VIP, so we were like seventh row, and of course I was sitting behind a tall guy, and that was. My phone, but she did a private performance and there was a VIP room and OMG was freaking awesome in there. It was cookies and hot chocolate and stuff and this is one of her costumes from something. That's the background of my phone right now. OMG. Hard to tell the lighting was kind of stinky. And she was playing one of her violins. She actually named so much. I think it was a great idea. There's the cookie. Sorry, I'm doing a mix of videos. I need to delete this picture because I have it here twice. Oh, there's my mom and I in the photo booth. Who did? Well, some people actually got to meet Lindsay, which um, I yeah, would have passed out probably. I mean, we were there from like 3 o'clock until when I mean, she came on, and didn't come on till 8, but you know, the performance was at like dinner time I was getting kind of hungry by that point because they didn't open up the food till and the souvenirs either till after so like I said we kept going back for the show and you know and the merchandise booth and the food and finally they opened it up you know that was and then of course I saw an old friend there too which I haven't seen this friend since it's been almost five years it was 2013 I think that I saw him last when we were living at this place in Moline, Illinois, called Transitions. I'm not going to talk about that place because it's not very pleasant. But I mean, unless they upgraded it a lot by the time last time I was there. But anyway, that's my pictures. Um, I should post this on. Hold on. My Christmas playlist keeps keeps going in a weird parallel universe. Let's see, here we go. They should watch the videos, like, awesome. I feel like I'm always playing the song over the other ones, but... Well, Becky G is in the song, the artist, who was in the recent Power Rangers movie that came out, like, two years ago. I think, is that right? Something like that, I can't remember. 2016 was a crazy year. Not like this one. So Lindsay, I mean, she's playing the violin and she dances. Including there's a bit where she tore over to dance with her dog, which is now. It's a white dog now. She died at pink. <laughs> I would probably do the same thing if I can if she let me. Yeah, I definitely am doing that video tomorrow and then Tuesday, Christmas. I'll be doing my stocking stuffers. I'm trying to put my phone here. Okay, that's what she had long hair. Instagram, I was going to see what I just did here. She likes singing a bunch of songs and videos. Here we go, 20 minutes later. 
sometimes interesting when people play their music on YouTube because sometimes the songs are either really annoying or just turn the music down. Especially when it's like, I don't know. I don't know. Really not pleasant. Okay. That's it for this video. This is a mixture of H&M haul slash update. Tomorrow, the next two days, I'm doing Christmas, and then Wednesday, I'm doing a Lindsay Sterling merchandise set. Now, I do have a poster, and I hung it up, so I'll show it. I'll take it off my wall if I can get it off. There's a lot of tape behind it, all these pictures, in case anybody didn't know. I mean, I use about, oh, I can't remember. Melon rolls of tape to get all these pictures to stay up over the years. I was in Texas, so it took me forever to get my Wonder Woman post drop. And that's Lindsay right there. She's been still running in here and filling radish on there. That's her best friend. I need to get some pictures. That's what I bought. That's my update of the last month or so of December. I hope everybody liked this video and I will see everybody in hopefully tomorrow, if not Wednesday. Again, it's amazing seeing Lindsay and especially the videos where the song was playing on the big screen and, and it was awesome. Nothing else really exciting. Everybody doesn't know how awesome Lindsay plays. You know, like, it's electronic music. I mean, this Christmas CD was re released this year. I mean, Gwen Stefani did the same thing. She made a Christmas album and then she re released it with more songs. So, you know, it's very awesome. I will see everybody very soon. Thanks for everybody for watching and Merry Christmas and Joel, good night. Bye everybody.